The wheel park were established in 1965. My dad, my brother and myself bought the company out uh, 16, 17 years ago. Since then, we've changed from a cam auto shop to we're now fully CNC. We do a lot of fluid power stuff, pneumatics, hydraulics. We have 12 star machines uh, and we've got like quite a broad spectrum of machines from 16 mil up to 32 mil. Recently we bought a 20R4, which is their latest SR machine. We've noticed big differences between the previous versions. We saved about 25-30% on the cycle time off a 20R2. Um, and we changed the job over from a, an SR32 onto the 20R4 and halved the cycle time. The majority of our machines run overnight because we do a lot of brass work. We've got two SR20JN machines that run on the same job 24 hours a day, 7 days a week and that's feeding hexagon bar. It was a big change for us changing over from a cam auto shop to our first CNC 12-13 years ago. None of the guys had any experience but the company recognised we needed to change direction um, and modernise or else we were just going to get left behind. Um, we plumped for the star machine uh, we didn't really look at any other machines and to be honest from experience since we have tried other manufacturers and had very very little success uh, not as reliable as the star machine. We had an issue with Star's main competitor where we bought a brand new machine and they took it back off us after two years, it wasn't reliable. Out of the two years we had it, it probably ran for a year and when we put it next to our 10 year old Star machine at that time, there was no comparison. Star sort of set a standard that not many get, get up to. When we first started with Star, none of the guys knew anything at all about CNC, programming, whatever. You know, they really kind of held our hand in the early days. We've got two apprentices on site now that are using the, the STAR training um, and hopefully they'll develop the way we want them to develop. We use STAR for servicing, we always have done. We get belting service off them, we can't, we can't fault it. We've, we've just phoned up for a visit this morning, the guy's coming tomorrow. We caught a cold when we tried other manufacturers, uh, we won't do that again. STAR are a very forward looking company, uh, constantly developing the machines. Uh, and improving them. You know, it's, it's a policy with us now that we're, we're continually investing in new plant. We've bought two machines this year, I think we bought two or three last year. That's the way we want to go. We don't want to get left behind.